Good morning everybody. Welcome to Tool, Tool Time Tuesday. I'm Greg. We're going to look at today new welding helmet. My other one died down here in Florida. The heat is pretty brutal out here in the shop. And uh, my last one, the lens delaminated inside the actual housing all up through here and started leaking fluid where it was melting the uh, the glues and the binders off the PCB board and everything else and the battery exploded so it was just it was just a bad mess and of course I have a helmet that uh, was no longer being supported by Miller of course I can't say a whole lot it lasted 12 years out here and uh, I think that was pretty impressive in itself but the bottom line is we had to shop for a new welding helmet and I gotta admit Prices have gone way up in 12 years. There's a little, little bit of sticker shock involved, but you kind of get what you pay for with stuff like this, and you have to stop and ask yourself a serious question. What are your eyes worth? Yes, you can go down to Harbor Freight and get you a $29.99 uh, helmet special from uh, China. Uh, you know, they got plenty of China guys over there that uh, don't mind getting their eyes burn out you know because something doesn't work correctly or the refresh rate isn't there but uh i kind of like my eyes a little bit so i try to stay with the good stuff like uh miller of course uh, lincoln uh 3m the speed glass series i love i just can't afford uh, but looking at the different ones there's a whole chart on Miller's website uh, that you need to go look at and decide where your comfort level is, you know, how much you're going to use it, where your price point is, uh, what you're looking for. Um, and out here in our shop, uh, I have uh, TIG, I have MIG, and I have uh, aluminum spool gun. So I kind of get all three of the, uh, the functions there. I don't do much stick welding. I never have liked it. I'm not that good at it, and that's probably why I don't like it, but uh, I like my TIG welding and my MIG welding more than anything. So that's primarily what I do. So I needed to get a helmet that can cover pretty much the whole uh, spectrum of what I, what I do. And I ended up choosing the Miller Digital Elite Series. Uh, I got the plain black one. Uh, basically, uh, you can get them with all kinds of patterns and designs and everything else. Uh, I chose the black one because I'm actually going to hydro dip mine in a camo pattern and then the wife's going to put the company logo on either side of it. So, uh, you know, you, you can do it yourself. You don't have to pay the extra 40 or 50 bucks for them to do it unless that's what you want to do. But this one, uh, well, that's, that's in a foreign language, so we, we're going to have to move around here to a different side. Uh... Optimize, it's got clear light lens technology, optimi optimizes contrast and clarity in light and welding states. Uh, 9.22 square inches of viewing area. I like that. X mode eliminates interference, ideal for outdoor, out of position, and low amp TIG welding. Very important. Because down here in Florida, the sunlight out there will uh, cause it to go on and off, and uh, sometimes that can uh, be painful. Uh, here we go. Now we got English. Clear light lens technology provides a brighter light state and crisp view while welding, enhancing visibility and reducing eye strain. Uh, you can see the three different stages and shapes that it does. I haven't used it yet, so we're going to find out how it does. Toggle between weld, cut, grind, and X mode for super performance regardless of work environment. X mode continuously detects the arc even if sensors are blocked, eliminating sunlight and out of position interference. That's probably the mode I'm going to be in 90% of the time because I don't grind in my uh, welding helmet. I don't do it. Uh, you know, these lenses and the helmets are kind of expensive, so why tear up a lens from sparks from grinding when you can get a, a simple face shield, shield for 20, 30 bucks that, uh, you know, when the lens gets bad, you can throw it away and get another one versus uh, $300 for a welding helmet. Uh, you know, I have to draw the line somewhere. Well, let's open this bad boy up and see what we got here. It's packaged very nicely. And inside here we have, of course, the welding helmet. 
we have register your product today literature I like your gloves the uh, glasses the safety glasses there are pretty nice I might have to see if I can find a pair of them there's the top of the line helmet but I just couldn't justify the, the cost of that but I sure did like it that reminds me of something out of Star Wars on that one that's kind of a, a wild looking mask right there and it comes with a nice little little backpack thing from Miller for keeping the helmet in. Oh, we've got a nice little liner in there and uh, even has a, uh, a pouch here that you can put your gloves or I don't know I guess you could use that for a hand warmer but it's got, a, it's got a nice pouch goes all the way down in there so you can put some safety glasses and your gloves and your, your snack for later in there. Nice little bag and here we have the obligatory, you know, who are you, what do you do, why are you going to use our product paperwork. And one thing that impresses me is right here. Is I like the fact that Miller goes ahead and knows this is, you're going to be using this thing. And they give you a whole stack of the outer lenses and a couple of the inner lenses. So that right off the bat, you don't have to go buy spare lenses. Because you know what? You're going to mess these up. Splatter, you know, something hits it. These get torn up. That's why they're there, so that you can replace them. And it's very nice to have some of these already in the kit, so that you don't have to buy something else right out of the box. But uh, I really like having the extra ones. And here we go. See that you can get it with some fancy graphics and stuff like that on there. And gives you a nice chart here on the um, lens that you should be using for the uh, process. Use your plate keeps notes. How to use it. We'll have to read that here after a while. But let's get down to brass tacks here. Let's get this thing out of the bag. Let's take a look at that. Nice uh, big viewing area here. Get the Peely label off of there. Digital Elite. Uh, nice big, uh, say, I believe that's a solar panel there that actually uh, recharges the batteries. And you got your four pickups there that uh, sense the arc. Now this one has got the... Uh, quite the uh, headband assembly here it adjusts in every position these little things squeeze in this moves in and out you have your stop here that has a little I don't know if you can see that it's got a little thumb there that you can rotate the stop position of the helmet to what you like and then inside we have uh, electronic controls of lighter, darker for the, the uh, lens setting, the, the uh, and activation time I'm shorter, longer, and the hold auto less or more. And then you can switch between the modes between weld, cut, grind, and X mode. Like I said, I'm probably going to stay in the uh, X mode the vast majority of the time. And it's got a nice rebel LED display there. The batteries are up underneath there. Nice thick flint. It's not thick plastic here. It's not the primsy. And then right here, you press in on these. Oh, bad boy. There we go. And we seem to have about and doing this for you. Know, you shield. This comes up. And then this is where you place your main shield. And then you piece out the inner where the whole lens go out. There's the shield. Uh, batteries. Very simple. There. But very, very fun. We put together very simple and to work on here. And has and this rise and it is around there. It's a up against so rubber that you don't get seal or stuff there to seal. Cause that between the tip dust and, and then that's back in there. But in between. So all so that snaps are very there. with this. All in all, uh, so far that I'm going to impress hydro dips and a can like Saturn and this y'all back ammo pack that done. Good luck. I'll bring you after we get.